Hey all, hope you're doing well. So today I'm here again with a different recipe with Dalgona coffee. So we are going to make Dalgona coffee pudding. So let's get started. So first here I'm making a coffee concussion just for dipping the first layer that would be the bread. So here I took around 2 cup of water and to it I added 2 teaspoons of sugar and one half tablespoon of instant coffee powder. As you all know, we have to beat the coffee mixture. Here I took uh, four tablespoons of coffee powder, four tablespoons of sugar, and four tablespoons of hot water. Double the quantity, and you can get the link in the description box how I made the Dalgona coffee. And you can also get it on the right top corner of my video. So here's the texture. So half of our work is done now. Let's get into the ingredients. Thick cream. Nestle condensed milk that we are going to add in the uh, Dalgona coffee and coffee concussion and bread slices also uh, I added a dream whip and biscuits that was any biscuits you want into the pudding now if you want you can add both the layers with bread also so for what you have to do is you just cut off the edges of the bread and, and store it in a container in fridge uh, and you can beat it into bread crumbs later so into another bowl I took Dalgona coffee and we'll be adding thick cream and condensed milk to it. Added one uh, whole packet of this thick cream and half of condensed milk, half a tin and mix it well. You can add it accordingly. I added a little more of Dalgona coffee to the mixture and mix it well. What you have to do is just store it in the freezer for like 5 to 10 minutes and it will be a little bit thicker than it is actually. So this was very simple. Next we will start layering the pudding. So taking the bread slice and dipping it in the coffee concussion and start layering it. So the first layer is whole of the bread. Actually I was supposed to uh, add bread in the second layer too but actually I have ran out of bread so plan to just give a crunchier effect and added second layer of the briskets so as you can see it's quite thick now it's out of the freezer and it's much thick than before so you can add it to the uh, bread layer and spread it evenly just add half of it what you have to do is if you want you can keep this tray in the freezer uh, just freeze it let it set or you have to freeze it around 5 to 10 minutes till you make the second uh, layer whip so here i took the uh, whipping powder and added a little bit of milk actually the box showed 125 ml of milk so i added that much and whipped it well to a creamy texture So as you can see our dripping cream is ready now. Next what you have to do is you have to add the earlier prepared mixture that's the Dalgona coffee, condensed milk and thick cream to the prepared whipping cream. This will be the final layer. So mix it well. So it's quite simple actually. So just beat it well, beat with a hand whisker or electric beater you want. Mix it well. As you can see the first layer is all set now next we are going to add the uh, biscuit layer that's the McVitie's digestive biscuits I just dip it into the coffee concussion and uh, spread it all evenly do break it into small pieces and don't forget to fill in the gaps too adding little bit of coffee concussion on the biscuits to keep the uh, coffee flavor drizzle in some uh, condensed milk if you want now this is optional so here goes the final layer that's the uh, dalgona coffee thick cream uh, and uh, condensed milk and the whipping cream so we are all set now just add it to the tray and spread it evenly So 
just for the garnishing purpose uh, kept around one to two tablespoons of dalgona coffee mixture and add it to the uh, tray and just swirl it around some chokozu kids uh, chocolate chip biscuits so just uh, powdered it and spread it on the top just to give the garnishing uh, effect so freeze it for an hour in the fridge and here's your dalgona coffee pudding ready to serve so hope you all like the video do try out the recipe and let me know in the comment section below do like share and subscribe to my channel thank you bye bye